What possible horrors await us in World 8? The U.S. government? Cast of Jersey Shore? Justin Bieber? No, it's just the rest of the Koopa Kingdom. Let's put on the mushroom and get down to it. Yeah, I I kind of made that intro up on the fly, so yeah, speed up. That quicksand is a pretty good shortcut. You have one of two paths available. Uh, I think I'll go with this one. Ah, this one gives you a crap load of coins. And if you have a P-Wing, it's pretty easy to get all of them. Maybe get an extra life. But, if you go over to this one, then there's a bit of a stairway, blah 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 blah. And hey, a leaf! Tanuki leaf. And you pop out of the same pipe. Either way! Whoa! Fireball. This is not a Toho game. This is not Don Maku. Woo! Slide! Boing! And bop! There! Easy! Alright, what else is there? A couple of pipes. There's the fortress. Whoop! Duck! Yeah, whoop! And whoa! Hello! Lava! Lava and conveyor belts. Not a good combination. As you might have guessed. Womp. Yeah, they really went all out for this world. Like, they're actually trying to kill you. Don't! Like, they succeed sometimes. And whoop! Dang it. Come on. Okay, come on. Seriously. Whoop. And let's see up here. All right. In here is a star. Nope. Other way. Yeah, the star pops out and bounces the opposite direction of which you're facing when it comes out of the block, so... And it's good for trampling ghosts! And if you make it in time, sometimes swamps as well. Whoop. Alrighty. Now there's a P-switch here. And I believe it is this one that you should go in. Yep! And you want to duck because there's a long row of spikes. Sharp and pointy spikes. Speed up. And whoop! Boom boom! On a conveyor belt. I'm on a belt! I'm on a belt! Everybody look at me cause I'm standing on a belt! Ah damn it! I just realized I should have used that joke last video. Man, I am terrible. Alright, well. There is a pipe back here, which basically takes us back to the beginning of the world. Or halfway through. You know what I mean. So, we go here, and one last tank stands in our way. Alrighty, yep. Whoop. Whoa, hello. Yeah. This one's even more claustrophobic than the last one. I say as I enter one of the more open spaces of the stage. Yeah, this here you can just press right on the screen and, you know, just keep, sw 
keep uh, pressing B to do the tail swish. Knock the rocky wrenches out of their holes. Whoop! Whoa! Hello! Jeez. See? Rocky wrench right there. You gotta know what's coming. Alright. And here we are at the last pipe. Let's do this. One more boom boom. Yeah, boom boom. Wanna beat those Mario brothers? Okay. This <laughs> is. Apparently, that's what would happen if Yogi Bear and King Koopa had a baby. I don't even want to think about it. Alright. And just to make it easy, you know, just to go through it. I'll use a P Wing. Fly through you. You can just rush those um, statues, and their lasers will go right over your head. So, okay, down an elevator, up an elevator, down the falling donut block. Yeah. Up here, secret one up. And it's pretty broken here because you have all these platforms. All these donut lifts, precision jumping. There we go, pseudo precision jumping. Door up here. Fly! Level broken! And gotta be careful this part because there are fireballs, but if you have the P Wing, hey, no problem! And. Fly up here, then you can just, you know, do a bit of a glance back, look at at least the top half of the level with that annoying sound. Alright, enough daydreaming, enough, you know, reminiscing. It's time to kick Koopa's ass. Koopa! Now, you might notice if you jump on Bowser's head, no damage. But when he jumps at you, he takes some of the bridge with him. That's the gimmick to this fight. You're supposed to trick him into falling into that pit at the bottom. Woo! -hoo. Hello! Boom. Almost there. Choo -choo -choo -choo. Tea bag, tea bag, tea bag. Whoa, hello. Tea bag, tea bag, tea bag. Ow. And down he goes. This is Sparta! Actually, no, wait. Dang it, I should have used that joke better. Alright, well, now that that's open, score's calculated, door's open, and we found the princess. We have found Princess Toadstool. Our long quest is finally over. Thank you, but our princess is in another... Wait, whoa, 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 what? It's pretty, oh, you little bitch. You had to pull a fast one on me. I thought I was going to have to do all those levels all over again. Alright. Yeah, I actually knew that was coming. So, that is Super Mario Bros. 3. Um, my thoughts on the project? Oh man, such nostalgia. I remember I used to have a, a bit of frustration here or there as like a five six year old kid when I played this but now that I know most of the tricks and everything it's um yeah it's pretty fun you never see Mario swimming sprite like that yeah 
There's Tanuki Mario. The statue. The Koopa praying. Everybody's slipping on ice. Especially that Goomba. You never see that sprite anywhere else in the game. Pipe maze. Uh, that was something I failed to show you. The Hammer Brothers suit. Which is basically gives you immunity to fireballs and allows you to throw hammers. And there we go. Castle of Koopa. World 8. And so that is it. Um, thank you very much for watching. I'll see what I can do and doing more frequent videos for sure. And also um, coming up with the next project. So until then, you guys have been a great audience for watching this. All two, three of you. And until next time, this is Silver telling you to stay silver.